Howdy everybody, Wild West Stacker here, and that is 54 troy ounces of silver. Oh look, that's 54 troy ounces of silver too. That's right, it takes 0.64 troy ounces just to make one solar panel. This right here is 84 solar panels, 23.3 kilowatt system. It's enough to power usually about five standard homes. Yet we still have an electric bill every month. And all that silver is inside of those solar panels. Wow. It's kind of crazy, right? Let's go take a walk and look at some of the solar panels here. The snow is melted off. I did not brush these off this time. Little lazy. They just keep going on and on. It is definitely a workout if you want to try to do this in the snow. All right, let's pass this bush. Got an ice slider right there. Nice. 84 panels. Whew. Go look at the back. Oh, it's dark back here. Wow, that's a lot of solar panels. And yes, they're all USA made. Now, one thing a lot of people don't know is all new solar panels starting in 2021 should use one third the amount of silver. So this same setup would only be about less than 20 ounces. So we are gonna use a lot more silver in the future, but the solar actually might go down some because of the new technology, so much more efficient. Big barn. All right, coming back to the silver. 54 ounces. Whew, it's crazy to think there's that much in all of those solar panels. But for you preppers out there, solar is not the only way to go. Some of you have batteries, lithium, some use sealed lead acid, adsorbent glass mat, AGM batteries. Well, we use so much power here that wasn't an option. So, if the power goes out here, let's go take a walk over and find out how we still have power out in the middle of nowhere. Oh, you can start to see it. See that big box up there? on the other side all right so when the power goes out in about five seconds automatically this bad boy starts up it is a v10 propane power generator we have it locked up in this cage so nobody really gets in there no animals and with that running I mean, that's the same size they told me that the Home Depot has to run it when they run out of power. So it runs all of our needs, heat, appliances, everything. That's the way to go. And then when the power comes back on, it turns off automatically, nothing to worry about. So solar and generator, that's the combo guys with just a monthly refill on propane. All right. Let's enjoy some of this more view of the snow here. There's my garage, the man cave. All right guys, it's Wild West Stacker. Everybody have a good one.